And what that is, is just basic fundamentals of being aware of your surroundings. Hi. Welcome to TTV. It is Saturday, June 17th. 23rd at 8 o'clock p.m. All acts are free with their $6 New York State Fair admission ticket and free for 65 years old and older and 12 and under. And on this day in history... On June 18th, 1812, 211 years ago, the War of 1812 begins. On June 19th, 1905, 118 years ago, the first Nickelodeon opens. On June 20th, 1975, 48 years ago, dun 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 Da -da 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 -da. Jaws is released in theaters on June 21st, 1788, 235 years ago, the United States Constitution is ratified, and in famous birthdays! Oh, see this link? Click this link. And in non-famous belated birthdays, Jim Dittmar, Lizzie Kulik, and Ali O'Neill on May 21st, Nick Calcagino, Randy Capriati Jr., and Melissa McDonald on May 22nd, Jordan Passant, Caitlin Farrell Bender, and Megan Muldoon on May 24th, Joel Montefiore on May 25th, Mr. Roy, Richard Roy, for those of you teachers who watch this podcast, and Jude Killar on May 26th, Quinn Delia and Ali Carmardella on May 27th, Shanley Murphy Currow, Paige Larioni, and Dan Markham on May 30th, Mike O'Neill and Ryan Greer on May 31st, Cassia Brooks, Taylor Perkins and Brandon Gessler on June 1st, Robert David Primo, Colleen and Colleen Finine on June 2nd, Tommy Sager and Mr. Keach. Ken Keach, for those of you who are teachers who watch this podcast, on June 3rd, Matteo Capriati on June 5th, 
David Baker and Harry Owens on June 6th, Jane Conahan, Brittany Ryan, and my grandma, R.I.P. Grandma, on June 7th, Christine Lavoy on June 8th, Kara Esposito on June 9th, Vivek Nayar and Vikram Nayar, Jess Palmero and Rachel Signy on June 10th, Ellie Pepperone on June 11th, Christy Case, Jeremiah Brissett, Mac Tomlinson, and Dino Spumoni on June 12th, Noah Welker, my mentor, Mark Upson, and Mrs. Kavanaugh, Deb Kavanaugh, for those of you parents and front row players, and Brianna Liatka on June 13th, Caitlin Tessier and Matt Corbett on June 14th, Shannon Fulham on June 15th, Alex Bethman, Michaela Jazz, and Monica Painter on June 16th, and Amara Pulver on June 17th. And in nine famous birthdays, Austin Barriger, Thomas Doucette, Courtney Michelle Dickinson, and Kate Bailey Halstead on June 18th, Cal Alexander and Molly Malone on June 19th, Dan Botwinick, Mark Hayes, and Marissa Minkstein Clark on June 20th, Christine Burns, Derek Curtis, Laura Mortalini, and my niece Hadley on June 21st, Robin Greenberg, Brandon Sugar Sugden, and Dave McCormick on June 23rd. And those are all of your non-famous belated birthdays and non-famous birthdays. So from all of us here at Tim's Television TTV, happy birthday! And in air show news... The United States Air Force Thunderbirds, the sky is our stage. United States Air Force Thunderbirds past air shows, May 20th and May 21st, Chenault International Air Show, in Lake Charles, Louisiana, May 27th and May 28th, 2023 Bethpage Air Show, in Wontaw, New York, June 1st. United States Air Force Academy graduation flyover at the Air Force Academy in Colorado. And on June 10th and June 11th, it was the Ocean City Air Show in Ocean City, Maryland. In the United States Air Force Thunderbirds next air show, June 17th and June 18th. West Westmoreland County International Air Show in Latrobe, Pennsylvania. And the United States Navy Blue Angels. How many jets are in the squadron? Hey, does anybody know how many jets are in the squadron around here? No? Okay. There's the number of jets varies at any given time, but the average number is 11. United States Navy Blue Angels past air shows May 20th and May 21st. Wings over Wayne Air Show at Seymour Johnson Air Force Base in North Carolina. May 24th, United States Naval Academy Air Show. United States Naval Academy in Annapolis, Maryland. May 26th. United States Naval Academy graduation flyover in Annapolis, Maryland, May 27th and May 28th, the Great Pocono Raceway Air Show in Long Pond, Pennsylvania, and this air show, the last one on here, is special for this community, June 10th and June 11th, the Great Tennessee Air Show in Smyrna, Tennessee. The last time they were there was 2016 when Blue Angel number six, Captain Jeff Kuchkus, crashed his jet 
and died. So, and they have, and you can go visit the Captain Jeff Cooch Cooch Memorial over there in Smyrna, Tennessee. He saved lives that day, even if it meant taking his. And the United States Navy Blue Angels next air show, June 17th and June 18th. Columbus Air Show in Columbus, Ohio. And in weather. The National Weather Service in Binghamton has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for extreme northwestern Broome County, Shimon County, western Cortland County, southeastern Schuyler County, Tioga County, Tompkins County, Bradford County, until 7 o'clock p.m. Sunday, June 18th, morning clouds and afternoon sun, with a high of 74 and a low of 53. Monday, June 19th, it's going to be partly cloudy, with a high of 80 and a low of 58. On Tuesday, June 20th, it's going to be partly cloudy, with a high of 81 and a low of 58. On Wednesday, June 21st, it's going to be mostly sunny, with a high of 82 and a low of 59. On Thursday, June 22nd, Sun and clouds with a high of 83 and a low of 62. On Friday, June 23rd, it's going to be partly cloudy with a high of 83 and a low of 65. And on Saturday, June 24th, make sure you have your rain jackets handy as there is going to be scattered thunderstorms with a high of 83 and a low of 65. And that's your weather. And in entertainment news. Oh uh, yeah, this follow-up film will explore the mythic journey of Paul Atreides as he gets together with Shani and Freeman while on a warpath of revenge against the conspirators who destroyed his family. Facing a choice between the love of his life and the fate of the known universe, he endeavors to prevent a terrible future only he can foresee. And that's Dune Part 2. And Dune Part 2, which is a continuation of Dune Part 1, comes out on November 3rd, 2023. And in events news... On Sunday, June 18th, Father's Day Car Show at Thrive in Freeville, New York at 11 o'clock a.m. On Monday, June 19th, open your mouth when you wipe your teeth. Sometimes you gotta let it go. You gotta let it go and let it out. Jessica Novak at the retreat in Syracuse, New York. At 7 o'clock p.m. on Tuesday, June 20th, afternoon movie. It's that Special Olympics movie we reviewed on this podcast back in March. Champions! And the Kirkland Town Library in Clinton, New York. At 2 o'clock p.m. on Wednesday, June 21st, it's Back Gammon Club. At the Salina Library in Meadowdale, New York at 3 o'clock p.m. On Thursday, June 22nd, it's Mindful Health Support Group at the Northern Onondaga Public Library in Brewerton at 10 o'clock a.m. On Friday, June 23rd, help! We need somebody help! When I was young, I never need, but now these days are gone. I'm not so so self-assured. Paul Davey at Crazy Daisy's Flower Farm in Syracuse, New York at 5 o'clock p.m. And on Saturday, June 24th, it's Yoga in the Park 
at Clark Reservation State Park in Janesville, New York at 8 o'clock a.m. I don't know about you guys, but <laughs> I'm definitely not getting up that early to go do yoga on a Saturday morning. I can do yoga from videos anyway. So, <laughs> no offense to the teachers. I'd rather do yoga by myself. And now, it is time for Tim's Joke of the Day. <laughs> What type of car does a chicken farmer drive? <laughs> oh, Lord. I, I don't know. Does anybody know this one? <laughs> a coop. <laughs> yeah, that was a good one, folks, wasn't it? <laughs> and you can email us at TibsTV1 at Yahoo.com. Like us on Facebook, Tim's Television TTV. And Tim Bennett Productions. Follow us on Twitter at Tim's TV One, and subscribe to Tim's Television TTV on YouTube. So, until next time, I'm Tim. Enjoy the rest of your day and week, maybe weeks. So, until I next see you guys again. I don't know if you noticed our new schedule, but, but lately I've only been doing one podcast a week. So, yeah. And, oh, yeah. I know I plugged this in at the end, but make sure you check out Tim's movie review of Champions, complete with me wearing my Special Olympics medals. And that's the end of the show. What I'm going to talk to you about today is personal safety awareness. And what that is, is just basic fundamentals of being aware of your surroundings.